This is the outcome so far. Japan is leading 4-0. It was a women's singles. Okahara to start it off. She's the world champion, and there's a reason why. Shelley played well, but too much to handle. 21-16, 21-17. Well, the depth of the doubles, what can you say? It was women's doubles, number one. Japan took that one, then followed by Sato in the singles. That gave them three to zero, and then we just saw in 23 minutes, the women's doubles number two. Well, up next, we have another women's singles. Takahashi versus Choi. Well, Takahashi, she's a fun player to watch. She likes to smash, she covers the court so well. A little bit like Lin Dan on her plays. Big smirk, but Choi, that's gonna be a tough one. She's the younger sister of the Olympic champion, so hopes to follow in her footsteps for the next Olympics. Such a great backdrop. The total BWF Thomas and Uber Cup Finals 2018. Canada, represented by Catherine Choi. Ampai, Jitirat Hanukit, Hanuk Akrapat from Thailand. Well, there you have it, the last of the women's singles to come out on court. Japan to lead the way, Sayaka Takahashi, followed by Catherine Choi from Canada. Oh, Catherine Choi, what a great experience. Yeah, we're watching you. Got to talk to her yesterday, and she's just absolutely thrilled to be here. Looking forward to some of her matches. That experience that she's going to get. Well, she's an all-around player. She likes to fight out on court. Uh, definitely, there'll be a battle out there, but if she can keep the shuttle in play, just to get used to the hall and get that experience, you never know, sometimes you can pull it off. Well, there isn't any heads-to-heads. -heads. This will be the first time they play each other and they're doing the coin toss. Black. Receive. Side. Well, Choi just getting settled in. This is probably one of her biggest matches that she's played so far in her career. And there's Sayaka Takahashi, 25 years old. Ranking is 17 at the moment from our Japan. Well, her best world ranking was number 11. She didn't play yesterday, and again, that's just because how many fantastic players Japan has. So she had a day off. A lot of options Japan has in their lineup. There's Catherine Chow, 17 years of age, 165 centimeters. Her ranking is not so great. Uh, another reason for it, she doesn't have 10 tournaments, and it's divided by 10. She's from Ontario, Canada. Catherine Chow yesterday did not play against India. Well, Canada had a huge win over India. India didn't send their strongest team to this Uber Cup, but uh, Ready it's a pray. good win. Well, there's our umpire for today, Than Rukpuk from Thailand. She's known around the world for her great umpiring. She's at very a lot of them. There's 
Chen Chen Shen from Chinese Taipei just checking out his lines for the service. That's what you see that stick in front of him with the black line. He looks at it. If it's under that line, it's a good serve. It's, if it's too high, it's 1.15 meters. It has to be below the shuttlecock when it's hit. And there's a Canadian flag. It's both Canada men and women qualified for this one. So big smiles. They played once yesterday. And Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Japan. Represented by Yasaka Okatashi. And on my left, Canada. Represented by Kisina Choi. Japan to serve. Lobo. Play. Well, this is a final match in this group play today. It's a fifth match. Hands winning four to zero in the tie, and it came to the Uber Cup Championships. A team of that. Wow! There she goes. That's a big smash. Let's get that one out, out of it. So it's over. There she goes. One Good way to start it off. That was a short lift, but she's going to take huge advantage. Look at that shot up in the air. 328 kilometers per hour. So it's over. One and the height all. was 2.7 meters. It's exciting to watch when the, some of the women like to do the jump smashes. A lot of the men do it, but you'll see you know, Yip Pu Ying over the years. She was one of the higher ones as well. Oh, fantastic shot again. She pulled that one off. Ah, big smiles. I like that too. So we saw Don't like it too much when two, you're on court against it, one. but hey, look at that. Two, zero, two, one. Service over to all. Oh, Takahashi, number 17 in the world. She likes to smash as well. She's a big left-hander. There it is. Oh, almost the same. I think there was a mirror on the last Three, few points. Two. That's what she did, a big smash. Watch it, sets it up so nice right here. Huge smash and then goes cross. That's Out. wide, a little nerves. Service over, three, all. Sayaki Takahashi. Her style is definitely a lot of smashing. Uh, that one not so hard, she can mix Service it up. Over, but when four, she has the time, three. very powerful smash. She has good rhythm, covers the court well, but not like the top two Japanese. They run down a lot of shots. She Five, also has a three. lot of attacking weapons, too. Oh, well, there it is. Look at that big lefty. It was a short Six, lift. Three, one, four, four. Didn't get all the way to the back, and you're going to be punished if you don't hit the lines at the back. So huge smash cross court. China, represented by Li Xiaolui. France, represented by Cartier Domo. There it is, quick coming into the net. That's what she does Seven, well. Seven, three. As soon as possible, you can hold it. Last second, and then snaps it. Comes in, rack it up, holds, snaps right into the corner. Oh, that's a wild one out the side. Set three. Nice high serve to the back. A little wild again out the side. There's a Nine, slight jerk to the right of the court, but you have to bring the shuttle in into the court. Again, a lot of the time it's mental. You have to realize you can have these long rallies. Don't hit their lines. Ten, three.
Service over. Four, ten. Takahashi asked to change the shuttlecock. He asked the umpire, and if your opponent agrees to it as well, but it's uh, the decision of the umpire if they say yes or no. And it was a yes, so quick change. Oh, beautiful placement. Five, ten. Troy gets her racket up, places it beautifully to the net. And that's out oh. the side. A few too many unforced errors by Choi. Service over, 11, five, interval. Japan will take that advantage. And she's done it in five minutes, it's 11 to five. to serve at 11-5. Oh. That's out the back. Giving Choi Service another over. point. 6-11. 7-11. Again, a lot of deception on that one. Cuts it right across. Service over. Beautiful shot cross 12, court. Seven. You can even hear the shot when she cuts over it. Her left hand goes up nice and high. Has so many different options. Well, Takahashi has won some tournaments already this year. In 2018, she won the New Zealand Open. As well as the Swiss Open. Last year in 2017, she won the Vietnam Open and uh, getting her ranking up as well. She's won a bunch of international challenges, which are the lower tournaments, but uh, she won the Osaka International. You know, 14, for her seven. Home country as well as a rich girl international. Okay, 17 in the world at the moment. A little bit too much. Service Try to over. force that. At 14. She had enough time, but just didn't reach up quite enough. Service over. 15. At. Well, this is the 11th time Canada has reached the finals of the Euro Cup finals. Nice deep clears to the back. Oh, a real high one from Takahashi. Waiting for her opportunity. Oh, nice rally. Oh, the deception was there. And Choi to the ground. Waiting for that opportunity. Watch, nice hold there. Gets a shorter lift and just cuts over the shuttle. Beautiful shot. Choi, oh, oh. Can't quite get to that. Great try. Sixteen, eight. Oh, good deception there. Nice net plays. Oh, it just tumbles over the net. 
it clipped the net coming down and making it hard for Choi to get back. And Takahashi playing the number third singles. That was going maybe wide. A quick snap down. At 10, at There it is. Oh, she had it. She was there. Little mistake. Service over. Set Nine, it up so nicely. Too much an end. Oh, that's oh. wide. Ten, eighteen. Oh, that's beautiful. What deception. I'm right behind the court. Service over. Takahashi comes up. 19. Just cuts 10. that shot, places it to the net so beautifully. Watch this shot. Watch her racket. Turns it. There it is. Great angle. Twenty game point ten. Well that's game point for Takahashi. Nice high serve to the back. Great depth. Choi, oh, game. just into the net. Takahashi first will take one by the seven. first game. 21, 10. Well, in 11 minutes, Sayaka Takahashi wins the first, 21-10. Great depth on the last one, nice and steady with Choi. Not quite high enough. Gives the game to Takahashi. You've got the big bomb, you've got the big smash, but it's about setting up, setting up, use the drops, use the half smashes, use the slices, and you know, all that variation is necessary. Okay? Keep going. Okay. Hot one to twenty second. Hot one to twenty second. Well, Japan to serve to start the second game off. They win 21-10 in the first game. Japan on the far so side in the dark blue and red shirt. Well, Canada's on the close side in white shirt. Catherine Choi. Oh, that's superb. Watch that big lefty, the power. Service so over. It was a short lift. One. Lots oh. of options. Wrong guess. Well, you notice Takahashi put on a knee brace after the first game. Again, another short lift in. Two, one. And that's gonna be it. Well, there's Japan. <laughs> what a great team. 
Sato did her job in the women's singles earlier. A few of them have a day off, but they're up 4-0. This is the 11th time that Canada... 3-1. ...from the Uber Cup Finals event. It's the 27th edition. And Thomas Cup is the 30th edition. When Uber Cup first started, they had seven matches. Four, one. They had three singles and four doubles. In 84, they changed that to five matches. Now it's three wow. women's singles and two women's doubles. Oh, there's a smash. That's what Choi needs to do. It's hard to do that. She needs to. She wants any chance of getting into the rally. Five, she needs one. to use her weapon, and that's the smash. But easier said than done. Sayaka Takahashi is on the other side, and she likes to smash too. Ball. There it is. That's what I'm talking about. Service so over. Mixing it up, a smash into Five. the body. She gets up again, a little bit of height. Puts it high, right on Takahashi. per hour. It's a fast smash and that's out the side. Three, five. Well, there's Canada. They did a good job in the women's doubles. And Rachel and Zai, both the doubles teams were there. Oh. Well, that's tough. Takahashi's smashing when she wants to. Places it so well. There's been a lot of Canadians in this venue. It's a beautiful venue. It's Impact Arena. Started off, Justin Bieber was here singing, Michael Buble, a lot of other great performers. Well, Celine Dion will be coming here this summer to sing in July. So, great performers here. It's beautiful. So it's all other all ones were Michael Jackson, six. Elton John. So. These players are in the same venue that these incredible singer singers were at. Oh, great attack again. It was a short lift. Service over. Seven. That four. depth, if that depth isn't there, Takahashi's power is going to be too hard to return. Choi needs to try to find that baseline, the back line. Oh. As four. Well, easier said than done. Great exchanges right into the back corner. Choi's fast on those Service returns. Over. Five, eight. Troy needs to play a little bit faster, clears. Trying to get to the net quick. Try to get that lift. Oh. oh Takahashi. Service over. Again, cuts over that shot. Nine, five. Serve wide, mixing oh. it up. But Choi with a nice smash cross Service court. Over. Six, Took a ten. little pace off of that. Great angle. Oh, nice angle. Hard Service smash. Over. Eleven six into one. Definitely. Takahashi wins the first game 21-10 and leading in the second 11-6.
just short lift. Well, Takahashi's all over that. Down it goes. Sayaki Takahashi serves that one. Well, six. She took the first in the opening game. It was 21 10, and now she's leading 12 6. 13 6. And she's marching away with it. Quick, a few quick little points. She's the most experienced player out there on court. Her sister, Olympic gold medalist in the women's doubles. Takahashi beat the Danes in the final. What a game that was. It was incredible. 14, 6. Great angle again. That left handed so quick. The racket just snaps it down. Short serve again. It's to the back. There it is. That's beautiful. That's short. Dangerous. Oh, she had it. It was there. Just a little 15, bit too much in at the net. Six. The right thought. She does want to try to get on attack before Takahashi does, but it's tough to do. Oh, good cross court shot. Nice. Oh. A little bit too much. 16, well, six. That's hard, especially when someone's on the other side. You're creeping in, watch it. Beautiful shot, but just watch Takahashi. She's there. It's a little extra pressure on. Doing thing with the short serve. And that's out the back. Service over. Seven, 16. Ah, uh, there's, she mixed it up on that one again, Service cutting over. over the shuttle on the smash. It's not 17, always seven. her hardest shot. Right placements. Great angle. It's only five grams, so to make that go so quick. Controlled environment, the smash has so been clocked at 492 kilometers. 17. That's 306 miles per hour. Fastest racket sport in the world. And that's so fun. Endurance, flexibility, power, agility. What a great sport. It has everything. Oh, there's a powerful smash, but that's out the side. 9.17. Just gets up on it too much and pulled it. You can see she didn't turn enough. Again, Service fantastic over. attack. 18, 9. Sayaka Takahashi is pulling away in this game. So quick up there. Troy was hoping it was going out, but no chance on that. 19, 9. Oh, nice cross court smash. Good pick up by Takahashi. Again, look at that big jump smash. He got off the ground on that. Troy. 
Fantastic. 10, 19. Picks the spot so well. Watch this. Gets behind it. Enough time for the jump smash. Puts it to the ground. That's smart. You need to serve short to Takahashi. Very smart. 11, 19. Again, I don't want to give away the high serve to Takahashi right away. Her attack is so good. Let's start with the short one. Ooh. Service over. 20, mad point. Choi yeah. was there, but just waited a little bit too long. Go up to the shuttle. Just dropped her elbow. Well, it's match point. Sayaka Takahashi, 2011. Game. Well, that's out the back. Sayaka Takahashi wins the final match for Japan. First game was 21-10 in 11 minutes. The second game, 21-11 in 14 minutes. 11. Japan wins all five of their matches today. Big smiles for them. They love it in the stands. Just let that drop a little bit too much and out the back. Well, Choi did a really good job. A lot of experience in that game and work on it. And long career to come. This has been a great day number two, session number one. Japan is dominant out there. They won all five of their matches. Well, Okahara, the bronze medalist at the Olympic Games, won the first one, 21-16, 21-17 to Michelle Lee. Then it was the doubles. Fukushima and Hiroto winning that one in two straight games. Well, then it was Sato, the Olympian from 2012, who takes that one against Brittany Tam, 21-14, 21-14. Then we saw another women's doubles in 23 minutes. Tanaka and Yomi Moto. And then the last one, it was Takahashi all the way, 21-10, 21-11. Japan to win 5-0. Well, they're in Group A. They're the number one seed, and Japan is leading the way with four points. Canada has two. India is struggling with zero and Australia. So Japan is very, very strong. Today's session was Uber Cup Group A. It was 5-0. Next up will be Uber Cup Group A, India versus Australia. That'll be a big match. And then to finish it off tonight, Thomas Cup Group A, it's China, the number one seeds, versus France. Well, a great way to start. That's the Uber Cup Finals, the team champion competition. The world's best are here. I'm Charmaine Reed, and we'll see you later.